taking the stats every minute this week. I'm doing my part, I'm paying attention, and I play my position. Hello, like Sabre back with another video. We're going to talk about a new Pulse Chain project that is launching uh, pretty soon. This is a Tomb Fork. Okay, guys, so if you're familiar with Pulse Rate, okay, Pulse Rate, uh, which is also a Tomb Fork on the Pulse Chain network. I know we've had a little bit of FUD on Pulse Chain with the SEC, but the good news is, is that, I was just about to type in FUD, but the good news is, is the SEC is now taking their attention off of crypto and going after AI. So, yeah, that's that's definitely good news for the crypto space. We saw the price of Pulse Chain shoot back up almost a full reshape recovery. The move's not over yet. But um, this is the this this is the SEC dip that we saw. Okay, um, it dropped down, it spiked, so it went back up, came back down, and we had a nice recovery on this chart. So post chain is looking good. It is recovering. Okay, guys, um, I knew it would recover. Um, the only question is, is how long would it take to recover? Um, the whole case with the SEC thing. That's a whole nother video. All right, guys. But the good news once again is. The, uh, the the SEC are now switching their attention to AI. I don't know what. I don't know if it's AI cryptos or whatever. I'm going to assume it's not crypto. Apparently, they're taking a break from crypto. They will get to crypto later. There's videos about it. There's articles. Go and check that out. Okay, guys. But ultimately, uh, Pulse Chain will survive, in my opinion. I remember it's not financial advice. Don't risk more than what you can afford to lose. Do your own research. But I personally believe that Pulse Chain will survive. And it's not been in a bull run yet. Um, I don't see the same thing happening to Pulse Chain as what happened to XRP. And um, one of the main reasons I will say is that XRP beat the case. So people are not going to be as fearful in buying a project like Pulse Chain. At this stage, I would say as well, especially it's not had a run before. So Elite is a new project or Toon Fork on the Pulse Chain network. All right, guys. And these guys are, well, I don't know if they're an experienced team or whatever, okay? But they've got um, some things in their statements that would suggest that they've got some experience. Um, uh, we don't know how extensive it is or whatever. There was a little bit, bit of fud around, you know, whether there was uh, um, members from different teams of different protocols. Um, but, you know, these guys are planning to do their own thing. They're planning to make their own name, okay, guys? So this is the protocol for the elites, uh, the newest standard of two for on Pulse Chain. Okay, for me, it's just gonna probably gonna be the same as every other uh, two fork at the end of the day. All I want to know is, can we print? Can we make some bucks? Can we make some gains on this project? You know how these things work. Okay, you have a token which is the which is a peg to a particular token. With this one, you have the elite. Okay, and then you have the e share token, which will be the share token, probably most probably the token that you will be yeah, that you will be receiving in rewards. The bond token or the e bond token that is for uh, the bonds, okay, guys, which we're not going to get into in this video. I don't like explaining these things personally. There's plenty of you guys, most people watching should be familiar with the tomb forks by now, so pretty self explanatory for a lot of you if you're new you might want to do a little bit more research but this is basically what the ui is going to look like of course this is not live yet okay guys so they're going to be having a pre-sale and remember once again it's not financial advice do your own research okay there is a whole git book or white paper that you can read through and catch up on everything that's going to be happening with this okay what i do expect is for there to be single staking and emissions to go live once this goes live and farming and I expect there to be high APYs. Okay, guys. Um, you guys can figure out your own strategy. There's a bunch of videos talking about strategies for these kind of things. All right, guys. If we look at the uh, list, which will probably be the main competitor. We've seen a few. We've seen a rug. Um, we've seen a rug recently with Pulse Axe. Okay. Um, I got in and out of that token. I didn't talk about it on the channel. But um, Pulse Rate is the one that's kind of killing it right now the aprs have come down significantly okay guys uh, but they're still pretty high still pretty decent uh, but what you'll find is a lot of people they pivot and jump over onto new new platforms 
um, they're chasing the APRs. So I expect the same thing to happen with Elite. People will be jumping over as long as the APRs are super high, which they most probably will be. This is for DGens only. Okay, guys, if you know how to play it, uh, if you know how to play it right, and the community gets behind it, it could perform just as good as the, uh, you know, as Pulse Rate did. For example, if we go over to the P Share token. Okay, so um, on Elite, you're gonna have the where is it? We're gonna have the E Share. Okay, on Pulse Rate, they have the P Share for Pulse Rate now. This pumped went absolutely nuts okay came out with a bang came down people people normally buy at the bottom as well okay guys so that's going to be your optimal buy price buying the bottom once it comes out once it drops okay guys buying it and then farming it up okay remember this is a reward token for so this performance is pretty impressive from pulse rate came down again going sideways and these sideways ranges are beautiful times to farm Okay, and accumulate the token and these uptrends as well. Of course, the downtrends are not so enjoyable. All right, guys. So, you know, remember, it's going to be super high risk, super degen. Probably not going to be a bunch of liquidity. All right, guys. But if you play it well, you should make a lot of money on these protocols. But remember, I'm not telling you to buy it or, or get into it or anything. You're going to make up your own mind. Do your own thing. But um, they will be having a pre-sale pretty soon. I don't have all the details, but they will be having a pre-sale. And that should basically get you into the ELT token. Um, if we check out the... Um, so you've got P share and then you have P rate. So the P rate token was basically bonded. The liquidity was bonded with uh, the P share token anyway. So the charts will look pretty similar, you know, with uh, P share and P rate. So, so I would say that the P share token performed quite surprisingly and that's because of the way they did it so you know um, you can make a bunch of money on both of these tokens that being said the rewards token is going to be the the E share token okay this is going to be the rewards token so this is going to be the most volatile this is going to be the one that people are looking to scale out profits and things like that most people tend to hold the bonded token okay guys um, or the peg token sorry the peg token I'm not sure what it will be pegged to on this. And, and of course, you, this is just a YouTube video, so you want to do your own research, read through the white paper so you can get all the information. Okay, guys. But um, yeah, if you want to be in the pre sale, uh, best thing to do is to come over and join their uh, uh, Telegram. Okay, guys. They do expect to have an audit, so some people might want to wait out for that. Um, but yeah, these guys, you know, they seem to know what they're doing. Their main aim right now is to build a community um weigh it out a little bit or they've been waiting out a little bit uh to push this on promo just because of the everything that happened with the pulse chain dip okay guys but pulse chain is going to survive it looks like it's doing well in my opinion and um yeah i see this uh potentially doing well as long as people get behind as long as people get over their fears with pulse chain which it looks like people are okay guys so i'm going to leave the links in the description read through the white paper or git book whatever you want to call it okay guys you can get all the details in here and uh, really that's all i've got for you in this video so do me a favor a lot comment subscribe tick little bell for notifications and i'll see you in the next one